Well, hello guys. Um, this is a little video about the error code CE348780. Uh, very common and angering code to encounter <clears throat> trying to play Battlefield, Madden, whatever game you want to play. This happens for every game. It's not just... It's, and one little mistake is people think it is EA. It's not EA. People think it's the maker of the game that they're playing. When it crashes, they think it's their fault. No. This is Sony's fault. I don't know what the hell is going on. I don't know what happened. But no matter what happens, it just seems that... I Like, I know Madden and Battlefield, the two EA games, those two are the two games I have, both of them crash. No matter what I do. Like, this... This, for me, the, I'm getting pretty far right now for what usually happens. Now... See, yeah, there it pops up. But... One of the problems is, is I don't know what the fuck is going on. But I'm going to give you some clues, or some, not clues, sound like fucking Sherlock Holmes. Um, some little help, helps, helping hints, or whatever. Go to settings, go to application, save data management. You go to save data in system storage, and then you click upload in online storage. By the way, this did not work for me. This is just many tips. I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos and trying to follow this because, I mean, I did just spend about a thousand bucks with all the stuff I had to get coming with this PlayStation, like a new TV, the games, new Wi-Fi and stuff. It's just, yeah. You're going to click on the Battlefield and hit Upload. Or whatever is there. Or, fuck, I already forgot. Click Upload in Online Storage. Click Battlefield. Click it. You hit Upload. It's going to show you the upload thing. It's going to ask you to overwrite if you want to overwrite the save data. You hit apply to all and you hit yes. Now for some people that will work. You go into the game and you test it. Another thing you can do if that doesn't work you can go here and this is just a temporary uh, fix. Well, some people have to do every three or four games you go to here you click that, click on it, you hit delete. Hit OK. After that deletes, you go and you play it. Now, after three or four games, or when the next time you see that error code pop up, you go back and you delete it again. And you have to just keep doing that every time the error code pops up, and it's supposedly supposed to help. Another thing you can do is you can rebuild your database which is you go into safe mode now I believe that this is different for every system that like the error code has a different origin for every error code some people say if you sign out and you go into the game like is battlefield here I'll do it for you right now I'll just some say that if you go on a PSN and you click sign out alright click on here you go into the game. Some people think it's for being online, which I don't believe that. It, well, it could be that, but I just it hasn't worked for me. I don't know what the hell to do. I just spent so much money on this. Well, well my dad didn't. You know, it, it was. I went through so much trouble to actually get this, and you know, it was a lot of things, and it's not gonna work. So, anyway. Click that. And it says you must be signed in to PlayStation Network. Yeah. Fuck you too. No. That's when once you get into that, you have to wait till you get that into that menu screen, the multiplayer and all that. You click sign in. Rai rai fan dude. But yeah. Now, once you sign in, you go back into the game, and you click multiplayer, and it will 
get you fixed up with Mr. Battle Log up here in the corner, if it works. It's going to say, welcome to Battle Log, blah, 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 okay. Quick match. And just do whatever it doesn't, I really don't think it matters. But I'm going to go to Conquest. And, you know, see, Sony really fucked us over hard. You know, they make, they have to spend us, spend a crap ton of money on this just so the games don't work. No? Like, yeah. Yeah. It's the same with Madden. But, see that little, that doesn't work for me. It can work for you. Just try it. You don't know. Just because it's my PlayStation doesn't mean it will happen to yours. But, you know, if anyone has a little solution to this, please leave a comment. You know, another thing I heard is that if you make a new user, uh, you can, like, in, you can, okay, wait, hold on. If you make a new user, you can actually play on that one without having the thing. It doesn't appear, apparently. But, see, the thing that's bad about that is that you lose all your online stuff. So, if you're playing Madden Ultimate Team, your Ultimate Team just goes out the window. Have to make a new one. Playing Battlefield and you're level friggin' 86. Out the window, you have to start all over again. And I really don't want to do that. I mean, if I have to, if that's the only way that I'll ever play on multiplayer ever again in my life, I mean, I guess. But that is pretty gay. But, anyway, like I said, if anyone has a solution to this problem, um, please leave a comment. Make a video or something, I'll check it out. I don't know. But, anyways, if there's anyone else out there having the same issue, which I know there are, there's many videos, search them all, watch them all, do whatever you can. You just have to figure it out for your own PlayStation, because I think it's just different on every PlayStation, I really do. Unfortunately for me, I don't have a solution. My PlayStation is just one of those select few that is fucked over, and I'm that one guy. So, anyway... I guess we just have to wait till the next update and hope that Sony gets this shit all figured out soon because I I, I really think it's kind of gay that yeah anyways thanks for watching please like favorite subscribe yeah see ya